But as you can tell, my gold is rising by a lot. So. Sup guys, it's Sakpa, and today I'm gonna be showing you a pretty awesome build about GUI script. Uh, it has a really cool new UI, and of course I showed you this before, but I had a few updates since, of course, Build a Boat has updated. So uh, I'm gonna be showing you all the cool stuff about it and how to use it, and of course I'm gonna be using it. Uh, guys, let me know down in the comments if you want me to do like a gameplay video of me just like building boats and just testing them out. I think that'd be pretty fun, but I don't know, it's really your choice. So guys, let me know down in the description comments. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy make sure to join the channel right down there I just got a join button and buy the merch you know tweet me DM me and I will include you in this video but anyways thank you to all the members supporting this channel and let's just get right into the video alrighty guys so once you're in the first link in the description your page should look a little like this and pretty much here what you're gonna want to do now is click on the black button that says free access with ads so it's right there uh, my mouse is hovering over it right now and pretty much what you guys are gonna want to do is just click on it so click on the black button and once you have done that it, on the next page you should say discover interesting articles which of course you're gonna want to discover interesting articles so click on that little button like there and click on it and now you want to wait on this little window for just 10 seconds and now that those 10 seconds are over what you guys are gonna be able to do is of course click on the top right of your screen where it has the X right there and click on it and if there's a green check mark that means you did the step right so now what you can do is click on the continue button like on the bottom of your screen right there I think I'm not that sure but anyways I think it's over there click on that and once you clicked on it give it a second to load and you should there you go now that it's loaded up you should see this page and this is gonna be the script setup download so after you do this download setup thing you're gonna get the txt file with the script of course so right now you're gonna be downloading an exe which is a script setup if you guys are confused don't worry don't worry it's alright it's alright just follow my directions and just copy after me so click on the black button that says download build a boat new GUI and once you have done that look on the bottom left of your screen left is this for you I think and then you should see build a boat new dot 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 exe and you're gonna click on the little arrow and then click show in folder now you guys should see of course the thing over here the exe and pretty much what you're gonna want to do is double click on it to open it up so double click and then it, give it a sec now guys once you double clicked on it it should say like do you want to give this access yes or no in a little window on your screen and of course you're gonna want to click yes and I can't show you that guys because it shows a black screen on the recording because it's a windows feature not just like a app so it won't show me that on the screen recording so I can't really show you that but just believe me on this uh, anyways what you're gonna want to do on this now is click on next second page click decline and then it's gonna say it's downloading and once it's at 100% completed and you see the txt on the top left of your screen yeah left uh, what you're gonna want to do is just X out and just like that you're done so now you can delete the exe if you want it's really your choice right click and you can delete why is my file manager frozen okay now that the, my file explorer is unfrozen delete the exe and now you can open up the script copy it and let's just get right into the video all right what the uh you're gonna take out your executor today i'm gonna be using synapse x but you can use i think quite a few other executors work with the script so it's not really only synapse x so feel free to try out the executor that you use but if you guys want a free chance to get synapse x every 1000 subscribers i give away one synapse x key for free and pretty much what you're gonna want to do to enter is make sure to leave a like on this video or on the videos that you watch leave comments nice comments on the videos that you watch and make sure to try to be early as you can and of course watch the video until the end and of course be subscribed that's pretty obvious and last but not least make sure to join my discord down in the description so i can give you the key if you win 
Anyways though, let's get that out of the way and let's attach our executor real quick. Now that it's attached, now what we can do is paste the script and execute it. Now, as you can see, here is the GUI. Let me close this and move this under here real quick. Alrighty guys, so now that we have it up there, uh, their Discord of the script creator is down in the description. So if you want to check out their Discord, it's right there. The script creator Discord is down in the description if you want to check them out. So, here we are. We have toggle GUI, which is right control. That means you minimize it, open it, minimize it, open it. Pretty simple. Of course, the Discord is right there, once again, in the description. And now we have a local player. So we have the uh, infamous walk speed. How fast we want to walk. Uh, pretty simple, pretty easy to use, nothing special, uh, just walk speed. And we also have jump power, which is how high you want to jump. So, uh, the higher you set it to, the higher you're going to jump. <laughs> pretty simple, pretty easy, not too hard to explain. And now we also have our hip height, which is how tall we are, kind of. So, the higher we have it, the higher we, like, walk normally, you know what I mean? So, like, the higher we have it, it's like, it's like our human suspension. <laughs> I'm not sure how to explain it. But it's something like that. Um, there you go. Let's set it back to default, which is like right there. Yeah, I think that's pretty almost normal. And we also have our FOV, which is how much we want to see of our screen. Of course, that looks a little too much. So let's just turn it down to like, geez, Roblox is really weird. I think that's pretty normal. And we also have our fly speed, which you guys can make your boats fly. I know, that's pretty cool. And of course, you can fly by your... What the heck? What is this? Uh... What the heck? I didn't know you could make that. This game is pretty cool. I didn't really know you could make such cool vehicles. Either way, though, you can also fly. Pretty simple fly. You can turn off the fly speed, like we said. Uh... Dang, dude, look at this freaking guy. That's so cool. Have you guys seen this before? Let me down. Let me know down in the comments because I've never seen that type of thing. Anyways, let's stop flying. And of course, we also have vehicle fly. So let me whip up a vehicle in just a second. I'll do that in a little, and I'll show you that. But we also have no clip, which lets you walk through like saw. Like I was saying, it lets you walk through solid walls. Uh, you know that was a solid wall. So let's check this out. So as you can guys see, I cannot walk. I cannot walk through. I'm running towards it. I cannot go. But if I turn on no clip, I can walk through it just fine. And same with this area, I can walk through here as well. So it's pretty cool how I can just walk through everything. So that's how no clip is. Oh, that guy's car flipped over. Alright, we also have infinite jump, which will make us infinite jump. So if we spam jump, the higher we will go. So that's pretty much what infinite jump is. And we also have reset and reset all values, which will make all of our like speeds and stuff like that default pretty cool uh, we also have our game options which of course is auto farm this auto farm pretty much will teleport you uh, so no it doesn't teleport you but okay so it goes to your island and it just like drags your body all the way until the end where the treasure chest is I'll be showing that at the end because it's pretty like simple and you also have auto buy so you can choose what you want to buy automatically uh, if you want and you can auto quest so, for some reason, it only works on the Magenta team, but who knows. Anyways, you can uh, auto-complete lots of quests, and they give you a lot of money, uh, so it's really good. Uh, you also have miscellaneous, so infinite blocks. Uh, as you can tell, infinite blocks. So, let me make a quick, uh, you know, nice vehicle real quick. Alright, so here we are with our, like, monster build right here, and pretty much... What you're gonna wanna do for now with the vehicle fly, let me show you that real quick. And let's also delete one of the seats. Oh, jeez, I'm glitching out. All right, let's delete this seat so we can have one singular seat because I'm pretty sure it glitches out if it has more than one. And let's launch. There you go. And just like that, we can, you know, go on with our day while we're floating. So it's pretty nice. Let's turn up our vehicle fly speed. So it can go really fast if you want or it can go really slow. And of course you can touch the ground or you can go up to the skies. It is your option. I really like this option because it's really fun. I just hit my head. Either way, I think this option is really cool for like if you're playing with other people because you can fly with them. Anyways, we also have our theme of this GUI which you can like change the color. Let's say we want the like the background to be like red. 
we put it over there and it's red so that's pretty much it that is and now we have here's the credits the dev and a ui library there you go and yeah i think that's pretty much all let me also show you the of course autocomplete quest so uh let me actually change my team to magenta and alrighty so now that we're on the magenta team let's click on autocomplete quest and just like that wow we complete the quest so it's pretty cool it gives you all the good stuff from the quest and you also find me this only gives you lots of gold i'm pretty sure uh i think it's like 1.5k so it is really good and uh pretty much just stand here just wait around and it will do the quest for you and uh there you go 1000 gold actually is only 1k but as you can tell my gold is rising by a lot so it is really overpowered and let me just you know what we can't even wait for it to finish you get the idea though we also have auto buy which we can choose something to auto buy but of course if we turn on the infinite build i don't think that's necessary are these engines they kind of look like it anyways though uh, here we are with all the stuff uh, It's pretty awesome honestly how like we can auto infinite stuff and we also have Speed uh, I mean auto farm <laughs> so let's turn it on and as you can t see this is what it does It just pretty much just floats you all the way through the all the stuff and it just goes and touches the treasure box Which will give you the end reward of course This is a really AFK thing. You, you don't want to be here while you're doing this, so I do recommend just turning this on, just dipping <laughs> so it does it for you. And pretty much it'll just fly down, touch your treasure chest, and just like that, easy reward and easy prize. So I think that's pretty much all for this UI. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please make sure to leave a like and subscribe down below. Remember that I make these videos every day, so if you could show some support by, of course, subscribing or joining a member down below, that'd mean a lot. Of course, remember that I just got March right next under my video, kind of. Um, DM me on Discord with a picture of you buying it or on Twitter at me, and I will make sure to put up a screenshot of you buying it just as a thank you. Also, if we're talking about thank yous, thank you to all my members down here. Alright, let's choose a spot, alright? Right there. Alright, thank you to all my members right there. It means a lot, all your support. And if you guys are trying to get added on this list of thank you members, uh, just become a member. And it's very cheap, it's only 99 cents for one first member. So, uh, hopefully you guys could support me in that way. And remember if you guys are interested in what type of monitor i'm using or what type of pc what type of mouse this is um, mic uh, or what type of mouse this is check them all out in the description of the video i have everything that i'm using right now like all my lights all my monitors all my keyboards all that good stuff but anyways thank you for sticking along to the end of the video and hopefully i'll see you in the next one bye